And we're joined by our colleague Michael Kiefer from the Arizona Republic, who you just heard a few minutes ago talk about witnessing uh, the execution. And Michael, I want to first ask you your response to the family members of the victim who say, for those who are focusing on the drugs and those who uh, think that these drugs didn't work properly, basically he said you can go to hell, that this was about their pain today and seeing an end to this case. How does that uh, impact your what, what you saw and, and what you you saw in that room? Well, they, Chris, they lost two uh, family members, and, and they've waited 25 years for something to be done about that. I mean, I think, you know, their grief and their anger is uh, is understandable. That uh, you know that, that here's someone that 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 they have hated for for all this time. I mean, they they and you know they it, it it's not wrong for them to feel that way. I don't think. And and they the, they saw the execution so differently than the witnesses. The journalists who were in the room saw him as gasping for air. They said it was snoring. Uh, how do you then? How do you? Uh, there were several independent witnesses who saw it as as gasping. They saw it as snoring. What was your reaction to that? Well, snoring is gasping. So, but but the thing is, the the the, the issue is is that uh, you know these things are usually done in a quick and efficient way, and there have been concerns about this particular drug as being inefficient. So when you compare um, when you compare a process that takes ten or eleven minutes, that and then you know at versus something that takes two hours, well. There, there's a problem there, and, and that had been the debate that was going on here. How do you think what happened today is going to impact this debate about the two-drug system uh, that has been the debate over the past few months? You are as much an expert in the death penalty and covering these as any journalist in, this, in the state of Arizona, so I want to know your opinion. How is this going to affect the national dialogue? Well, I, th this is what the, the court battles were all about. The court battles were about, is this going to work? Is it uh, an effective chemical? You know, where did it come from? And all those questions turned out to be valid questions. So it, it's, there's going to be, I think, some serious questions asked of, uh, of this department and uh, uh, of, of the process. And I would be surprised if we see this combination uh, being used again in Arizona.